What's going on, everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com. And in the last Dynasty video, we kicked off Season 3 with the game against Virginia, and we got beat by 4. We just played awful offensively. We had a good second quarter, but couldn't do anything in the second half. We had 6 drop passes, which is the death knell to any pass-happy attack. And we just couldn't recover from it. Our defense played well enough. But our offense has to step up in order for us any chance to win this year. And it doesn't get any easier, technically, because we're going up against Navy, who's a triple option team. This was a request from somebody to go up against a team like this. And it's just no fun because, again, the, the game gets you juiced up when you play against a run-heavy team. Uh, but we'll see. Maybe we can beat them. They only got to see overall talent, so that gives me some hope that maybe we can beat them. But, again, they're triple option. I think they run a 3-4, if I'm not mistaken. But before we take on the midshipmen, let's go to recruiting. We're going after four guys, defensive end, Leroy McGrew, great shape here. We're moving up his list. We just need a positive pitch. Next up, we got corner, Zach Spinner, top of his list. We just need a positive pitch there. Charles Harris, defensive tackle. We're in, again, good shape with this kid. And last but not least, we have middle linebacker, Jordan Floyd, who may be a future defensive end for us. But we're number one on his list, and we're starting to figure out at least what he doesn't like. So we're still doing okay. We didn't get hit too much by that loss to Virginia, but we got to win today. We can't afford to lose a goofy game like this against a team like this. No offense to Navy, but let's go and check, see what their uniforms look like. That's pretty slick. Do they got an alternate? They do. They got an all-white look. I think we'll go with their traditional. I think that looks fine. All right, so our pass, we just need to play better offensively. Defensively, I'm trying to keep my expectations low here. It's just triple option. Let's pray they don't have an impact halfback. If they do, it'll make things even harder. We just need to execute and play well, and hopefully we can. We'll see what we can do here. So it looks like we don't have a televised game. We're going to go straight to the coin toss. We won the toss. I want the ball to start at the second half. Uh, let's check out their... Uh, actually, I need to show you. I made one change. Can I show it from here? Uh, the only thing I did change was I added shotgun wing tight end. I replaced gun normal with this right here. It gives me a better third and long play, and it still has a couple of our basic screen and shoot stuff in here as well. So this technically just fits the offense a little bit better. So I just wanted to point that out. In terms of those audibles, I, I can go ahead and tell you, I probably need to change a couple of these. I don't use audibles a ton of my offense. I mean, we had the best, one of the best offenses in the country last year and didn't really need to use any. Uh, I'm going to go put these two in, in here just because they're good man beaters. So we'll see if I can get around to maybe using those. The rest of those I don't really need. But let's go check out their roster, see what we're dealing with. All right, quarterback. Well, the good news is they don't have any true speed at a quarterback. The 70 for their top two guys, but 84 of their third stringer. And this was my fear, an impact halfback. So we all know just – Bear down, just hope for the best that he doesn't break 30 tackles on us today. But 92 speed, his backups are pretty solid as well. So they got a good group of halfbacks. Uh, this is their B back, technically 84 overall, 70 speed. Wide receiver, just okay, nothing special. They got some size there. Uh, tight end, those guys usually just block for them. Look at their offensive line 72, 78, 84, 82, 78. So not bad, I guess, for who they are. They run a 3-4, 76 and 65 on the edge. That's a freshman. Defensive tackle, one decent one. Of course, he's going to play pretty much the bulk of the time until they go like to maybe dime or something or maybe nickel. Uh, but they don't have much behind him. Linebacker, 68, a freshman. Then they got 78, impact guy. Then 76, 76, 74. So a good little group of uh, middle linebackers, which is what they need in a 3-4. And right outside linebacker, 76. Corner, 78 and 70. Then you got 74 there, uh, free safety, 87 speed, true freshman. That's actually a pretty good pickup for him. He's tall. He's got some speed to him. Uh, but strong safety, it's not very good at all. Maybe we can go after him, maybe with some like rollouts or something, possibly. We'll see about that. But they got an awful kicker, and they got an average punter. And I do want to check. I just want to make sure Heath and Massey kind of have their reps more or less split. So there's Massey. We got both of them in that formation. We'll see how often I use that today, though. It's going to take me all season to kind of get used to having it. Uh, but they got Massey there, then Heath, Massey, Heath, Heath, Heath. I need, I, I probably need to put Massey right here. Let's just do that. Yeah, let's just go ahead and do that, just so they can kind of split the reps at least a little bit. All right. Fingers crossed. Let's just hope for the best. 
again, going against a team like this, it's just not easy. I don't care how low their talent is. But we need to execute ourselves. Let's see if we can get a stop. Uh, this ain't good. Great return. So I don't know why we can't... I just don't know why we can't get returns like this hardly ever. But look at this. Everybody just gets tossed around. I saved a touchdown, more or less. I'm going to go... So normally what I like to do... I like to do like a lot of one highs and such. And what uh, make get off there? Somebody tackle him. Gonna pick up seven. I like to do a lot of backside, you know, under fronts. It just gets a free release from a defensive end who can maybe pick up a quick tackle, that type of thing. So we're gonna do something like this, perhaps. I mean Go like right here. They got their impact guy at the B back position, but then he goes to the other side. So good pick. Say that's what I'm talking about out there. So the backside defensive end can make that tackle. If he if I didn't have that under front, I, who knows what would happen there? So they're gonna go. I'm gonna go goal line. This isn't. They're not going goal line here. At least I don't think they are. They probably got something else. Yeah, they're going that flex bone wide formation let's do something here stop him oh, i don't think he got it that's close nice good job defense i was not expecting that Ooh, they're mouthing off interesting uh so we're going to do middle fan that's huge i don't know how many times we're going to force the punt today but that's one of them don't fake it oh i didn't well okay yeah that was smart yeah I didn't really mean to fair catch, but I'm glad we did. So let me make a couple of adjustments. Let me go put my tight ends here, and I'm going to put my tight end right there. So we're, what, on the left hash? Let's just start off with P. Reed, I think. So the last game kind of scared me a little bit. We had a ton of drops. So I'd like to get the run game going a little bit better. And that ain't good. We have to go around this way. <laughs> that could have been an utter disaster. You look here on the left side. So they went spy with their defensive ends. I, who would have thought that was going to happen? So I had to come back around here because I was going to get tackled there. That could have been just really bad. So where are we? I'm actually going... Uh, yeah, let's just leave that as is. Uh, we'll go halfback screen. I may have to move around Massey and Heath a couple of times because Massey needs to be catching the ball too, but I don't think Heath has dropped a pass yet this year. Good play there by the freshman. Get a first down. We're on the right hash. I may just stay here and we can go stick. We'll go to one of the outside receivers. Cover one. Great throw. Good job, Westerman. Good job, Spencer. Get a first down. Second and two. Let's do our screen, tunnel screen. And they're going zone, so we will definitely go to Spencer on this one. Get up field. Just don't function. That was weird. Odd, I don't know what happened here, so it ended up being a decent throw. I just didn't know what Holloway was doing. That kind of confused me. He just kind of went to the, I don't know. Either way, we got the first. That's okay. So we're on the left. I want to stay here. Don't have anything simple that we can throw at him. Let's do cross-up hitch. So we have some options. Just want to make sure... Uh, yeah, we'll have to go over here. He's too wide open. Good play there. Get a first down. That play's technically designed to go to the tight end, but Massey was just way more wide open. From here, I want to try P. Reed. Zone dime. I may run the ball. Uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and do it. I like the numbers. I wasn't expecting a massive hit by that dude right there, so that makes it, what, second and nine? Left tackle botched that one. And they're going zone. 
We'll go to Heath again on this one. Get a block right there. Not bad. Pick up what? Makes a third and two. I may do P read from here. Just give me the option. They're going man. They're doing that. I like the numbers. I think I can get the first down. Handing the ball off. But he's not the fastest. Have you noticed? He's just not a very fast runner. I think he's got like 90 speed. But it's first and 10. So we're on the move. I'm going to go after. I think we got the room for it. I'm going to go after that safety. Their weaker safety is the one on the right. The strong safety. Maybe we can do a rollout here. I'm not feeling a whole lot of heat. And they're going cover two. Touchdown. Good job, everybody. Nice. So that was a good clean drive. Right down the field for six. So that was a good call. They went cover two zone. That's the ideal coverage to run that play against. And Bennett was right there and he made the catch, which is, again, just make the catch for me. This could be uh, maybe a good thumbnail. Something like this will be pretty good if I can zoom out a little bit. Uh, do something like that, perhaps. Let me go ahead and get this one while we're here. I've been capturing playbooks for college football 25 and I've had to change my settings a little bit. All right. So that's a good start. Forced a punt and went down the field and scored. Let's try to do the same thing. Extra point first. Seven to nothing. Did we had to we had to convert what? One third down on that one. Uh, this may be going out of bounds. I think I hit the button too. Yep. Hit the button too early. So you think Heisman kicking is tough on well, this game? Go play college football 25. That's that's not for the faint of heart, which I like. I mean, they made it challenging. Before, it used to be like really simple. I'm going to do something like this. Good tackle. Going to be what? Second and eight. They're going goal line. I'm not going to. No, we're going to go just do a cover one from four three. I do not like doing goal line of those normal downs and distance. Only on the short yardage when you know they're going to just try to pick up the first. Good job, Bale. I was able to get around the guard. So that makes it, what, third and five. I honestly don't know if they'll run it here or not. I may. Let's just go cover two man. Like, usually five yards and in on third down, they like to run it. If that's what they like to do, of course. I'm going to do this. And let's just hope for the best. Play action. And he makes the catch, and it's a first down. Of course, they pass it on that one. Let's do a one high from nickel. It says they're going three wide. And I, that was a complete botch right there on my part. My linebackers did not shift on that side for whatever reason. I guess I didn't mean I didn't shift them myself. Let's do cover one from here. I want to shift like this. We need that. Make a tackle. Still picks up about four or five. We'll go back to another cover one. I'll control the middle linebacker this time. I may just control the A gap. I just got annihilated. Do you see that? That center destroyed me. Look at that. He just pushed me back six yards. So it's what, third and short? We're going to go man lock from goal line. And it looks like they're going basic goal line themselves. So we're going to do this. Please don't do that. And I just got destroyed on that play. Golly. He pushed me back another five yards. Oh, well. So, again, this is the the hard part of running, going up against this type of offense. They just get their first downs and just do enough. Make a tackle, somebody. Anybody. 
So this is the reason why I do the backside, the under front. Well, we had a defensive tackle come through, and he still couldn't make a tackle there for whatever reason. So I don't know what happened there. All right, in the first quarter, we won that quarter, but they're fixing to probably score on us, but maybe we can get a stop. Second and six. See, this this game's going to fly by because you're just going to run, run, run. Fullback dive to the left. That's my guess. And I, I pushed him back there, so I, I think I helped a little bit on that one. So that makes it, what, third and short again? They're going, I think, basic flex bone normal here. Yep, I guessed that one correctly. I'm going to get everybody down. I fully expect a run. Tackle or don't. Just sit there and look at it. Just awful. Front line, everybody got pushed. Look at that, everybody got a push. I was the only one who kind of got through, and it didn't make a difference. So they're going to score because of the game. That's just kind of how it is against a defense like this. So we're going to need a break or two today on the turnover side to have a chance to win. Because I'm telling you, this is it's just tough to go up against a team like this. I think they're going to go probably to. There you go. Somebody came through on that one. We need more of that. And they're going goal line some more. Or flex bone tie, whichever one they want to go with. They're going to do this. I'll control the back side. Hopefully I can do that. Just in case they decide to go off tackle to the left. Nope, they tossed it that way. And good tackle forward. Good job. So that makes it what? Third and goal from the seven. Um, I'm going to go, uh, they may throw the ball. It's possible. I'm going to go cover two just in case. But we'll do something like this. And they got their impact guy in the backfield or in, in the slot. Somebody get him all day to throw. Touchdown. Dang it. Dang it. Just terrible. All right. So the goal is we just got to stay ahead of them all game because our defense, I just, I don't know if we can do it or not. It was just a bad drive. They just could not get off the field. I guess next time I'll go zone on that. It doesn't matter. I, mean, I think they were just determined to get a touchdown on that one. I don't think it mattered what I was going to do. All right. So back on offense. Let's see if we can get the lead back. Face mask. Call it next time. Man, that was an easy face mask. Let's go with this tunnel screen. And they're going 5 2. We're going to leave it as is. We'll go to somebody on the right. Wide open there. We'll take it as many times as they want to give us. Get a first down. Next thing I want to try, I want to go stick from spread. Uh, wide open to the stick pick up about seven there good job second and three I'm actually going to stay here and actually we're going to do basic yeah let's just do halfback screen we're going man I'm going to leave it as is I, I almost wanted to move Harley just see if I can go up against that strong safety but they're going to go cover one great throw first down We're on the left hash. I may just stay here. We can try P.E. Reed. Zone down. I actually may throw this one. Just get some yards with Heath. I'm going to go too tight in. Uh, I actually got some stuff here. Let me just see what I have here real quick. Uh, we can try running back flats. They're going zone. I'll probably have to go to Heath on this one. I wish they'd go man. I'll have to just bring him down. Get a first down. I had a slant that could have been open over the middle, but I honestly just did not look at him. I just didn't think it didn't seem like a good idea to even bother. 
Uh, let's try screen again. We're going to flip it. We'll go to somebody on the right more than likely. Cover one. Ooh, that was great catch by Holloway. Bad throw by Westerman. Had to come back for it. And it's second and one. We can probably do P read again from here. Their impact guy's not out there. That's nice. Not a big fan of that shift that he just done, but I think I still may hand the ball off. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. <laughs> this is terrible. <laughs> Again, they went double spy. It freaked me out. So I went back around and I just, I'm sorry. This third and forever. Oh, that was so bad. That was Herculean bad right there. Just whatever. So what I may end up doing. Do something like this. Let's see if Spencer can help us out. Whatever, whatever. Oh, geez. I, I, they went cover three. I, I had even less faith on it. I'm like, well, let me just go to one of the go routes and hope for the best. So we need breaks like this today to have a chance to win. And we did it. This will be a, a pretty good one. Back in uh, uh, something like this, maybe. We can get. Uh, I don't like any of that, actually. Let's just go ahead and move on. I already got one thumbnail. That's good. So we're on the four. I don't want to do anything crazy here. Uh, apparently he's out. Okay, never mind then. Let's do halfback direct. That's a good goal line play for us. Hopefully it will be. I was looking for Heath, but Heath is gassed, apparently. We'll go over here. They got an extra block or an extra defender, but can we get a stop? Of course not. Nobody blocked. Not a single person blocked. Good job, everybody. Both of those guys came through. They just stared at it. Let's try slot screen. Let's see if I can get a little screen over here to Bennett. He may get a second touchdown on the day. Get a block. Get in there. Oh, we didn't get in. You're kidding? I'm going to go halfback direct from Y trips. Hurry it up to the line. I definitely don't mind calling halfback direct a goal line. You just do what you got to do to score. We barely got it in, but barely. Oh, all right. So we got the lead back. So a wild first half. The half's about over with. I'm here to tell you, this game is going to fly by just because they're going to run so much clock. And I, honestly, I forgot to look at the clock while I was doing all this. I probably could have ran a little bit. Now, normally I don't run clock till the fourth quarter just to kind of give myself a bit of a challenge. Make it a little harder. So what we need to do is survive the next 38 seconds and go to the locker room with a lead. Really good kick. Really strong. Can he get in the end zone? Nope. He's going to return it. Good job. All right. 33, four seconds. I don't know if they're going to try anything here. But I'm going to go cover two, just in case they want to pass. Flex bone normal. They may just run out the clock. Play action. Somebody make a tackle. Face mask. Dang it, Lawrence. Holy. We don't, they don't need our help. Trust me, they really don't need any of our help. Uh, let's do basic Tampa two. That may have got them a little pumped up to maybe want to try something different, but we're going to do something like this. We'll do an under front just to see if our defensive end can get through on the back side. My guess is they're going to run the ball, though. See, the clock's still running. Okay, so I didn't know what they was going to try there. Hope for the best on this one. Ran me over like it was nothing. Block, broke, broke a tackle, broke a tackle, broke a tackle, broke a tackle. All right, so it's Hail Mary time. I'm going to go nickel. Cover two man. That's my Hail Mary defense. I'm going to go after him myself. It said they was going to go three wide, but they must have a sub package in there. He's got all day to throw. 
There you go. Good job. So, oh, there's one second. There's, there's still another chance. I'm going to go dime cover two man this time. Sister, it says legit five wide. We'll do this. Hat on a hat. We should have two extra guys on the back end. Sack. Gary, there you go. All right, so we that's a good half. I'll take it. We're up a touchdown. Against a team like this, I, I wish we'd be up more, but they're just eating up clock. We can look at that time clock here in a minute. But 183 on the passing yards. Uh, we got negative rushing yards. Is, am I reading that correctly? And that's because that one terrible play I had that we dodged a bullet somehow. Both teams are doing an incredible job on third down, though. 80% for them, 100% for us. But no turnovers. Both of them are keeping it clean. But you look here. Actually, the time is not much different. They're a little bit ahead of us. But it's not too much. But Westerman is technically playing perfect at the moment. 13 of 13. Of course, we're giving him like the easiest throws possible. But he's doing his part. 176 yards, one touchdown, no interceptions. Running the ball. Uh, I'll try to do better. I'll try not to go backwards next time. <laughs> Jeez, that's awful. I'm trying to remember the last time I've done something like that. Anyway, uh, running. Oh, I don't want to look at them. Let's go to receiving. Heath with four. Spencer's got four. Bennett, so on. So we got five guys got to touch the ball through the air. But Spencer is got 77 yards. Massey with 35, 31 apiece for Bennett and Heath. But Bennett has the lone touchdown. You go to defense. Everybody's kind of sharing the wealth there. A lot of twos and threes and such. Tackles for loss, same thing. We got... One tackle for loss for four different guys. We got one sack by Peterson and no interceptions. So let's get back at it. We need a touchdown here in the worst way. We I feel like we've struggled as of late coming out of the locker room and in the third quarter trying to do something. We need to do something about that. So we're on the 25. Let me see. I'm going to go back. Let me just see what I have here. Uh, I may try RB flats again. And they're going man, but they're going dime. What in the world? They're double teaming him. Okay. Cover zero. We'll go to the tight end. Can he get it? Nope. That's six points. Or that's intercept. I thought it was going to be intercepted. He just couldn't get to it in time. I tried to take him over, and that didn't work either. Let's try quick slants under going zone. I was hoping they wouldn't. Maybe we can get some yards out of this one. Nope, he's not open. Get up the field. Loss of yardage. Terrible. Awful. Complete mess. Uh, let's try scissors in. And they're going zone. The only way we have a chance to get a first down is probably going somebody on the right, more than likely. Cover two. Yeah. Huh. Shoot. Jeez. Good enough throw. We made the catch. I was kind of hoping. I, I tried to put a little English towards the sideline, and it just didn't happen. But great play by Harley keeping the drive alive. All right, where are we? Let's try P. Reed from Trips. Oop, nope, we're definitely going to throw this one. We'll just probably go to Harley. Get some yards there. Get by five, maybe. Not a whole lot. I'm going to try second and five. Let's just go here. We can try stick. Zone again. More than likely go to somebody on the right. He's not open. Almost get the first down, but not enough. Heath. Third and one. Halfback screen. Zone again. We'll go to our halfback, and we'll see if we can just pick up the yardage. I'm going to bring another help. Go over here. Just get the first. Barely got it. Just enough. So where are we now? Uh, first and 10. I'm going to go. I'm afraid the more I do something from this formation, the harder it's going to be for us to. Let me go halfback streak. Let me try something. Like for running the ball. See, their strength is their middle, their linebackers. That's, and I'm, I'd like to keep them off the field a little bit more. Going cover two. Good catch by Spencer. 
we may end up going right back to him. I'm going to go back here. Actually, I want to go deep post. I don't know who we're going to go to on this one. Uh, let's maybe Sanders. And he dropped it. It wasn't the best throw, but it was catchable. I felt like it was catchable. I, th I had to throw a little lighter. I thought that linebacker was going to like a swatter or something. And he just, he just whiffed it. Third and three. Let's go halfback screen. And they're going man. In order to get a first down here, we'll, and they're going, yeah, we'll have to go to Holloway to keep it safe. Oh, killer catch. Golly. And I threw that little light. I don't know what happened. I thought I tried to hold down the button. That didn't work. I want to try. I got Heath out here. I'm going to go. Let's go basic halfback dive and see what happens. Just to throw something a little different at him. Who is on? I don't like any of that. Have to go over here. And a, just our front line just could not hold up. Just too easy for him. Second and 11. I'm going to go linebacker attack. And they're going zone. I may have Harley or Holloway go over the top like that. Cover two. Touchdown. Perfect throw. Impact quarterback. Thank you, Westerman. Good call, Al. Great throw. As good as a post against cover two as you could ask for. Six points. Now we get to see him throw a little bit deeper. Do a little more tougher throw. So you go back and look at this. So I went and hot routed my go route, or this curl to a go to distract that safety, just in case they went cover two. And thankfully they did. So they split the safeties, and we had a post. I just hit him over the middle there. And my offensive line held up just enough where I can make the throw right there. Six points. Great job. Let's get an extra point. When you get on defense, try to get another stop. Right down the middle. So those are the throws that are really fun. If you can go down a field, hit you some digs and posts and things of that nature, you can have a whole lot of fun with it. You just, you know, have to throw it more. Normally, and I've been throwing a lot of shorter stuff, a lot of touchdown, check down type plays. It's just safer. But maybe Westerman can handle some of the tougher stuff now. We'll see. He's playing great today. They're going four wide on this one. I think I may go one high. I think they're going to continue to run it. So I'm going to go right here. I'm going to spread out just in case they go halfback. Nope, they're going to go dive. Good job. Somebody came through there. I think that was Bean. Good stop. Now they're going with a bigger set. I'm going to still stick with 4-3. I could probably run a little 4-4. I just now thought of that. Do something like this. Make a tackle. Good job, 47. And that makes it, what, third and seven? I'm going to go basic Tampa 2. I think they're going to pass it. So let's stick with our, our go-to right here. I'm not going to shift because they may run the ball. And they're going to run the ball. And look at this. Oh, hell. Hell. Dang it. A glitch play. Messed it up. Look, a, a glitch play pretty much. And I, I just goofed up there. That's just my fault on that one. Oh, my gosh. That was a surefire loss in the backfield, and we just couldn't handle it. Let's do this. Well, at least our crowd is loud enough to where they're struggling with it. Good job. Good job, everybody, on that one. Let's do another one high. I'm going to blitz my middle linebacker. Looks like they're going normal. I'm going to just try to plug up an A-gap. Hopefully this center doesn't push me back in the stands. Good tech. Good job, 47. And I was there to help him out. 
So it's third and nine. Can we get a stop? I'm going to go nickel this time. Let's get a little speed out there. I actually may throw in some, go back to my cloud coverage. I'm going to spread out like this. Surely they're going to pass it. It wouldn't shock me if they ran it, though. That's their strength. Intercept that. Good job, Waters. Got a hand on it, and we get the force to punt. So this is probably the key of the game right here. Can we go down the field and score a touchdown? If we do, we go up three scores. Maybe they'll shank it really hard to the right. That would be nice. Maybe we have like a beeline to the end zone. That's a pretty good punt. I'm going to fair catch that one. I don't think we can get much out of that one. So we're on the right hash. I'm going to... Let's go with halfback screen. I always like to do the tight, the compressed sets, like in the middle of the field. They just tend to work a little bit better, for me at least. I'm going to bring him out to help out the blocking. Go over here, and nobody blocked. Not a single person blocked for me on that one. Second and ten. Let's try stick. We'll go to somebody on the outside, more than likely. Cover zero, but I had to. I had no choice but the oh killer. I had no choice. I, if I threw it too hard, I would have got sacked. See, they came and threw. I had no time to throw, honestly. So that's why I threw it lightly. If I held down the ball or held down the button, he would have hold down. He would have held it more, and I would have got sacked. So we're lucky we got the yards we did, honestly. So where are we? We're on the third and three. I'm gonna try halfback screen again, and we're going zone. Four, three. I'm just going to let that clock roll. I'm not going to rush that. So it's 21 to 7. We need to get a first down right here. I almost want to go P. Reed. I just don't know if our offensive line can handle it. So let's just go halfback screen. We got hurt a few times last year with that. Let's see what happens. I'm hoping that strong safety is on Harley and they go cover zero. And they're going cover zero. Let's see if he can get it. Nice. So this was an interesting play. You go back and look at this one. I called it. I guessed it. Let me just put it that way. So that's their biggest weakness on defense is that strong safety. He's just not very good. But at this point, we got a go route by Harley and an out route by Holloway. And I'm just kind of reading the safeties. Both of them come up. And I'm about to run for my life. So my offensive line, they blitzed hard again. They, were, they sent two extra guys, but I was able to avoid the sack. And we got the first down. So we're in the middle of the field. I'm gonna let's do a halfback dive with Heath. I'm gonna flip it. And of course they put that on impact on the play side. But I like that shift. That helped. Uh, no, just terrible. There, was there anything up the middle? I could have went right there. Possibly that's probably my fault. Either way, I didn't get much blocking anywhere else. But um, I that makes it what second and forever. What's a good idea? Let's go screen. I, well, I kind of wanted to go stick, but that's all right. All right, they're going zone. I need to think about running clock, too. I'm going to come over here. Just another run play, and it's just a terrible... Just nobody block. Look at this right side. Did anybody block for me? Bennett. Bennett's the only one who chose to, and Harley, I don't know what he's doing. So that makes a third and something. Third and twelve. Let's go half back corner. All right, in order for us to have a chance to get a first down here, we're going to have to more than likely go to Harley against a cover two. Thankfully, that's what they're doing. And he drops it. He dropped it. Right where it needed to be. And he just dropped it. On the 30, I don't know if I can make that field goal. I can... I'm going to try it. That gets us up at 17. And that would be worth it if we could go up three scores. And my kicker's decent enough. That I think he can make it. So it's just going to be 100% on me on this one. That may work. Go, Al. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Awesome. Play of the game right there. Nice. That could be a good thumbnail. 
something like this would be pretty cool. If I come up here, something like something like that, maybe. Uh, something like I'm trying to something like that, maybe. I don't know. We'll do something like this, possibly. Either way, I'm gonna go ahead and get this thumbnail while I'm here. Oh my gosh! Crazy, 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 crazy! Great kick. Good job, out. All right, so we're up 17. Technically, we're up three scores. That was the only reason why I went for that field goal there. Otherwise, I probably would have went for it, honestly. Unfortunately, we kicked it to their best player. I hit the button too late. Face mask. I saw it from a mile away. Thankfully, it's just a five-yarder. Singleton. They're going to get it on the 31. Uh, are they going to run the... I, I don't... I'm gonna, let's go cover one. Maybe they got to start passing now. I, I don't know what they want to do here. Let's control just all the gaps here. Ooh, I, I'm actually supposed to go like right over here. So let me try that. Broke the tackle. That could have been really bad. So he's got a thousand yards on in his career. First and 10. So they still dead set on running the ball. Even though they're down three scores. We're going to try this. Let's see what they do. Tackle them, somebody. Pick up another seven, eight yards. Let's try another one high. If there's any positive to this, they are chewing up clock. Just one step closer, I guess. Good tackle by the freshman. So that makes it, what, third and four. I fully expect a run. So we'll go dog goal. So I got to pay attention. I'm supposed to go between the ta defensive tackle and defensive end. So let me see if I can do that. But let me read something like this. Come through. Get him. Nice. Oh, what? Pass interference on who? On Ford, when's the last time he saw a defensive pass interference in this game? Did he do it? I didn't see it. They called pass interference on Ford. Where was it? Explain that to me. How was that a pass interference? Um, okay. Somebody's going to have to explain to me. I didn't see any pass interference whatsoever on that one. But they called it. We got to get past it. Let's go here. Let's just control the line of scrimmage if possible. Get him. Oh, man. Almost had a sack. And another face mask. Dang it. Quit calling face mask. Another one. That's like four on the day. Oh, just abysmal. I almost got a sack, too. Let's try one high from nickel. Uh, let's do something like this. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Great play. Somebody came through. I think my middle linebacker, Hale, came through. Destroy the center. Must be nice to be able to do that. And we got the sacks. That makes it, what, third and... Or no, that's just second and ten. What happens if I do a zone blitz? We're about to find out. I'll control the mic. They may just run the ball. It won't make a difference, but... What is, what's Sanchez doing right there? Do you see that? What's he doing right here? Look at this. So he had every opportunity to get a tackle. Like, here's, there's that tight end. He's like, nope, I think I'm just going to just Olay this thing. Oh, that's pitiful. Third and one. We'll go nickel one high. And they're, and they're going to pass that. I was not expecting that. Good job, Newton. Fourth and one. They should go for this. And they are. I think I may do another one high. Because, again, they may pass it or something. Who knows what they'll do here. I'm going to try something like this, maybe. 
Backside defensive end maybe can help out. Oh, get him in. Ah. Went with triple. I think that was the wide receiver option play, actually. That's a good little play call. I try, We tried, though. We just couldn't do it. Couldn't get a push. First and 10. We'll do another one high. When we get the ball back, we will definitely be able to run clock. Do something like this. Intercept that. That was close. That should have been picked. Second and 10. Uh, yeah, let's just do one high from 4-3. I still think they're going to run it. Even with with three wide. Do something like this. Don't run to the left. We're kind of vulnerable over there. And they're going to pass it. Get him. Oh, that should have been. All right, good stop. I actually think that was T up. Third and 10. I'm going to go Tampa 2. I'm assuming they're going to run the ball. So we're going to go with Johnson. Flex bone normal. That fullback, he is a monster. He hasn't got to do a whole lot today. That's not their strength, but make a simple tackle, somebody. Make a tackle. So it's fourth and three. What I'm going to do is I'm going to send, we're going to go Tampa 2, but we're going to blitz. I'm going to send an extra dude. And they're kind of running out of room, so I'm okay with calling Tampa 2 from here. Let's do something like this. Nice, it worked. You go back and look from here. I've done a backside. I've done an under front. Got the defensive end that way, but somebody was able to come through. And it was my blitz and nickel. Nice. Great play. So we're on the right hash. That is game. Minute 30. I think we can just run the ball. Let's go halfback dive. We'll do it from a bigger set. And this may be a bad idea against their decent linebacking core, but we'll try it anyways. Go up the gut this time, maybe. Just just nothing there. Look at this. I mean, nothing got... At this point, I'm thinking, all right. But it got stuck. And just nothing. So they've given up. They're not even calling a timeout. That's good to know. I may try to dive again. We'll do it from spread. Uh, I, this actually will work as long as that impact linebacker is on the slot. But let's run some clock. I'd like to get a first down and officially end it. They may call a timeout after this play, maybe. Be kind of a waste of time. Dude, dang it, get upfield. Just nothing. Perfect play call again. Look at that impact linebacker. Plugged up that B gap. Gave me no chance to go to the outside. I had to cut up, and by the end, it was too late. So, again, just our offensive line, just it doesn't help when your left tackle gets blown up like that. So that makes it, what, third and nine? What's a good idea? I may try. Let's throw something a little weird at him. I do have J.D. Heal. This is our backup quarterback, our freshman, who can run it a little bit. Let's do a little speed option. I forgot he was in the... I completely forgot he's in gun tight. I just now realized that I had him in there. <laughs> Ow. So he actually has some pass, uh, some yards today. Can we get the first down? Let's just get down. All right, good job, freshman. Again, I that's I just now realized he is my, that's my sub package for him is that formation. I probably, what I need to do, honestly, I probably need to make the, here's what I need to do. I need to make this my, sub pack or my jd heel package i'm gonna put heel there we throw too much from this formation it's just part of our shoot offense so let me put in westerman like that that way i won't forget so going forward this is like our goal line short yardage oddball stuff so that's what we'll do going forward now that i just now realized it so that makes more sense now i'm just so used to using gun tight in our screen and shoot That just shows you I don't even pay attention to who our quarterback is half the time. <laughs> All right. Either way, good game. I thought our defense done a great job today. Uh, offense done fine, too. We only put up 24 points. I think a lot of that was just Navy running a lot of clock and such. But we stopped that option. So you notice what I've done. I've done cover one. I always had a linebacker blitzing. 
and I always done an under front when they allowed me to do so, when they had like a tight end out there, things of that nature. And that kind of done a decent job slowing it down. Now, they don't have the best town in the world, but at least I may give you a little bit of a blueprint of how at least I like to try to stop the triple. All right, stats and score. So 297 to the 125, just not much offense in general today. 314 yards passing. We ended up with negative yards rushing. Go job, you know, that was that massive, terrible play. It was the play of the game. It was the third and 31. And then... Uh, Spencer converted it. Just goofy all around. As the whole sequence was just kind of changed the game. But both teams done a good job on third down. And neither team had a turnover. That was nice clean for both. And go to individual stats. So, yeah, so J.D. Hill had two uh, can, uh, two throws today, and I just did not even pay attention to it. Um, shows you how pay, much I am paying attention to the things. But Westerman, 24-27. He played about perfect football. 307, two touchdowns and no picks. His best throw, I guess, was that... Uh, slot post uh, to Harley for a touchdown. That was just really nice. Running the ball, again, that could have been a lot better, but I just goofed up with Heath. That's my fault on that play by Heath. 100% on me. But receiving, Heath led in that. He made up for it, I guess, in the receptions. He didn't get to do much with it. But Harley ended up with the most yards of the bunch. Spencer is right behind him. You look at the touchdowns, Harley and Bennett. I thought Bennett had a pretty good day, too. Defensively, Freshman middle linebacker Henry Owens. Of course, he is our other starting outside linebacker. So he led there. Then he got Junior and uh, Lawrence. So we had two freshmen pretty much leading tackles today. That's pretty cool. Tackles for loss, Lawrence and Peterson. Then he got sacks. We had a couple, one by Hill, one by Peterson. And we did not have any interceptions. So you look at the box score. I guess we stayed consistent. We got a touchdown in every quarter except the fourth. But we got that key field goal to at least go up three scores and pretty much put it out of their misery. All right. We can breathe a little bit, but not too much because we got a massive game coming up. Well, let's go ahead and sim the week. We have number six, Oklahoma coming up. Whoo, that's going to be a tough one. And it's at Oklahoma. I can't wait for that one. I can't wait to go. I'm a Tennessee fan. We're going to take on Oklahoma September 20th. I'm going, I'm excited. And that's another re big reason why I kind of scheduled them. So let's go and check out top 25, Scores for the week. So Alabama, Georgia, LSU, Iowa won. Then he got Virginia Tech, Purdue. Nebraska got upset. Arizona State won. Then you have Ohio State, Auburn, NC State, uh, Texas AM winning. Then you have Michigan, Cal, Oregon State, Wisconsin winning. Then you have Florida, Miami, Akron, Texas Tech, and Virginia over Florida State. So Virginia. They're having a, they're just, they may end up going to national title game. Who knows? All right. So let's go and check out recruiting. That should have helped us at least a little bit. We went up for the defensive end. So it's us, Ohio State, and Virginia. We just need some information on them. You go over to the corner. We're already number one on his list. He got it down to his top five, which is good. We just can't get any feedback from him. And uh, defensive tackle, Charles Harris, number one on his list. It's us and Ohio State. Just can't figure out what he likes. And then we got middle linebacker Jordan Floyd. Same difference. So all four of these guys, we're in great shape for. We just can't figure out what they like at the moment. Let's go to Sports Illustrated. Top 25 polls. You got USC, Florida, Miami, Michigan, LSU, Oklahoma. And we are out of it. I don't think we're going to be. We're probably in the 30s or something by now, if I had to guess. You go to Heisman Watch. Westerman may still be on there. They still got him number one. Um, he didn't get to do anything that first game. Second game today, he played, I thought, really well. Bat perfect football, honestly. But he only ended up with 307 yards because, again, Navy just ran the clock so much. But he's still number one on this list, which is, again, pretty cool to see. We'll see if we can hold up on that. Let's go to Players of the Week. Nationally, wide receiver for Akron. Cool. Anthony Harris, I don't remember him. If that was a guy that we recruited or whatnot. That was several years ago, so my guess is probably not. But we're going to take them on later in the season. An outside linebacker for Central Florida had a good game. You look at the Big East, quarterback for Connecticut had a good game. Really good game. Five touchdowns. And a free safety for Louisville had a good game. Conference standings. Nobody's really played anybody yet, but we are going to check out the team info screen. No injuries. Westerman I'm assuming Heath is going to lead in rushing, kind of the way I have all my P.E. reads set up. It kind of goes to him a lot. Uh, hopefully, we won't have those massive losses like we've done today. But Spencer uh, is leading there, and you look on the defense side. Freshman, John Lawrence leading in tackles, and we got Peterson leading in sacks with Newton with one interception. Now, let's go check out Oklahoma. 
They got a tackle out. Their starting quarterback's got two touchdowns, no interceptions, and they got a running back averaging 150 yards a game. I'm assuming he's an impact guy. We'll find out. And they got a wide receiver putting up almost 100 yards. So they look like the real deal. I'm sure they're going to be right out there competing for everything towards the end. But defensive leaders, they got one guy leading in tackles and in sacks. He's pretty much the entire defense. And they don't have anybody with any interceptions as of yet. So that's who we got coming up. The Sooners. Going to be a fun, entertaining game. Hopefully I can make it look halfway decent. It's going to be an absolute uphill battle. We got to play perfect to have a chance to beat them. You look at their stats. They got arguably the best rushing attack in the country. They also got the best defense as well. Number two in overall yards, number two in rush defense, 17th in pass defense, and their turnover differential is pretty good as well. So, hey, yeah, they're just pretty good. But we're not too bad either. Maybe we can uh, pull off the upset. You never know. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later.